All right, and hello, B and J High School students. Let's read through some scripts and look closely at them. So try to listen and understand. And uh, let's begin. This is number 40, so let's begin with number one. Number one. Jane, you are busy as a bee. Yeah, thank you for coming to help us. How can I not come? By the way, what should I do first? You'd better ask my father what you can do. Who is your father? That's my father over there. He's wearing a baseball cap. The man repairing the broken steps? He is my uncle. The one changing the window panes with the new ones? No, he's checking the fuse box. So what is Jane's father doing? What is Jane's father doing? He's checking, he's checking the fuse box. He's checking to see if it's working and to make sure that everything is okay. So he's taking a look. So let's look at closely, let's look more closely at some of the sentences in the script. You are busy as a bee. You are busy as a bee. Busy as a bee means very busy, very busy. So, one, so someone has many things to do. You'd better. You'd better, so a suggestion, you'd, you had, you had. You'd better ask my father what you can do. You'd better ask my father what you can do. The man, the man, repairing, repairing, repairing what? The broken steps. The broken steps, repairing means fixing, fixing. The one changing, the one changing, changing what? Window panes, window panes with new ones, with new ones. So changing window panes. Window panes are the pieces of glass in a window. Pieces of glass in a window. All right, number two. Excuse me, but you must return to your seat. The seat belt sign is on. Can I go to the bathroom first? Yes, but please be quick. The captain is expecting a little turbulence in a few minutes. Will it be bad? I doubt it, but dinner will be delayed for a while. Okay, then can I please get something to warm myself? I feel cold. Of course. Wait a moment. I'll bring you a blanket. Thank you. So what does the woman ask the man to do? She asks him to sit down. And where do you think that this conversation takes place? Where do you think that this conversation takes place? This conversation takes place on an airplane, on an airplane. Let's see. So will be, but dinner, so dinner, dinner, will be, will be, future, be delayed, be delayed. Passive voice will be delayed for a while. Delayed means push to a later time, push to a later time made to be late will be delayed for a while for a while means some time some time could i could i being polite could i please get please get or please have something something to warm myself to warm myself to make myself warmer so she bring what does she bring him what does she bring him she brings him a blanket. She brings him a blanket. Good. Number three. Oh, number three is up here. Okay, number three. What's the matter, John? You look confused. Well, some of my friends and I are planning to get together this weekend. We are thinking of going to the movies. Why is that a problem? The math test. I'm having a math test on Monday morning. So, if you want to do well on the test, you should not hang out with your friends. But then they will be upset, right? That's the point. I really don't know what to do. I don't see your dilemma. Did you come to college to be a social butterfly or to get an education? To get an education, of course. I've decided to stay home. Thanks. 
So what is John's dilemma or his problem? He doesn't know what he should do. He doesn't know if he should go out with his friends or prepare for the math test. So I, so my friends, my friends and I, so we, we are, we are, my friends and I, we are planning, are planning, are planning, remember B verb, I-N-G, we are planning to get together, to get together, it means to meet, to meet this weekend, this weekend. So my friends and I are planning to get together this weekend. So dilemma, what does dilemma mean? Problem, problem. Did you come, did you come? So past question, did you come to college to be, to be a social butterfly? So to be a social butterfly means to be really sociable and talk and hang out with many, many people. To be a social butterfly. All right, and let's continue on to number Where is number four? Oops. Sorry, I read number four first. Let's look at number three. May I help you? So this is number three. May I help you? Yes, please. I have a reservation. My name is James Hall. So what's his name? James Hall. Just a moment, sir. Uh, yes, I have it. Okay, I just need some information. Address? 325 Longwood Avenue, 325 Longwood Avenue, Philadelphia. Will you be using the car for business or for pleasure? Business. And how long will you need the car? One week. All right. May I see your driver's license and a major credit card? Just a moment. Oh no, I left my driver's license in Philadelphia. So what is the man's problem? What is the man's problem? He left his driver's license in Philadelphia. And where does he live? What is the man's address? 325 Longwood Avenue, Philadelphia. 325 or 325, 325, 325, same. Will you be using, so future, will you be using, be using, so in the future, in action, will you be using the car for business, for business, or for pleasure? For pleasure is for, for, for fun. All right, and let's continue on to number five. Number five. There are several things you can do. First, you can join a frequent flyer club. On many airlines, you get a free ticket after you fly 25,000 miles. If you are a member of the club, if you are a member of the club. Another way to save money is to check for the lowest fares on the internet. You can compare prices. And finally, try to purchase your tickets ahead of time if possible. You can usually get a big discount if you buy your ticket a few months ahead of time. So this is advice for what? This is advice for what? Saving money while buying plane tickets. Saving money while buying plane tickets. The lowest, the lowest fares. What are fares? The prices of tickets, the prices of tickets. The lowest or the cheapest, the cheapest. Ahead of time, ahead of time means early, early. Ahead of time means early. All right, and let's continue on with number six. Hi, may I help you? I'd like to rent these movies. 
Do you have a membership card? No, I don't. If you have one, you can get 10% off. Do you want to have one? No thanks, I'll just take these tonight. How much? New releases are $2.50 and old ones are $1. Very reasonable, then I'll take this one too. Let's see, two new ones and three old ones. When do I need to return them? They're due back the day after tomorrow. So where does this conversation take place? This conversation takes place in a video rental store. So if you have a membership card, how much money do you get off the price of a movie rental? How much money do you get off the price of a movie rental. You get 10% off, you get 10% off the price, 10% off the price. And what are new releases? What are new releases? New movies, new movies that just came out, that just came out. They are due back, they are due back, they are, they are due back the day after tomorrow. So not tomorrow, but the day after tomorrow. So if today is Tuesday, the day after tomorrow is Thursday. The day after Wednesday, Thursday. They're due back, so you must bring them back or return them. Return them the day after tomorrow. All right, so that is the end of this video. So we will continue with number seven, number seven in the next video. So see you then.